Here in my hands here, we have something called a piddock, um, which I love the name, piddock, so it really rolls off the tongue quite nicely. They're also known as angel wings, more commonly known as angel wings. Um, and you can see why, they kind of, you can imagine a little fairy or angel either side of these, but it actually is a shellfish. And these shells come from two different piddocks that I found, and they would very much have a similar shell on the other side, and they would be together like that. And what's really unusual about this shell is if you took your finger and you run along the edge here, it's actually quite ridged. Um, and that's, that's done for a reason, because what these guys do is they don't typically bury themselves in, in sediment or on shingle. What they do is they'll find soft chalk or uh, kind of soft muddy um, rock and they'll actually twist themselves in and they'll use these ridges to twist themselves in and then they'll uh, be hidden in these little holes that they create for themselves in these little ch uh, chalk reefs and things like that and then they'll, they'll filter feed from, from that position. So you can see that the Solent actually is full of life and it's just a little more hidden. You have to just kind of know where to look for it. So the strand line's a great place to do that. Rock pooling is definitely a great place to do that. But obviously, if you are visiting our shores, make sure that you show the respect to those animals and living things uh, deserve. So also make sure that you guys are safe here. If you are handling anything in rock pools, make sure you wash your hands afterwards. Make sure that any um, rocks that you turn over, you gently put back everything back where you found it, basically, and take care handling anything out of the water, especially if it's fish or crabs, because they need oxygen in the water to breathe. So just be mindful of things like that. If you want to learn more about what our Solent holds, we have a fantastic project, The Secrets of the Solent. We have, uh, you can go to our website, find out more. And if you want to do, go even further, Further, you can become a marine champion, become one of our volunteers and we'll actually train you in some of the further secrets that the Solent holds and you can help promote that knowledge, that understanding and reach people and um, basically inspire people about the beauty of our natural world.